First off, uh, the government says no link between the heat waves and the deaths. Uh, yeah, that's right. Uh, we are seeing uh, one of the worst spells of heat wave in, in the eastern part of the country and some parts of south as well. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, initially one doctor actually said that all of these deaths in one, one city in the uh, eastern uh, state of Uttar Pradesh were linked to heat waves, but then it was swiftly denied officially. Uh, and it's easy to do because heat wave symptoms uh, are, are cardiac arrest or diarrhea or, or uh, high fever. And when these deaths happen, you can actually attribute the deaths to any other cause rather than the heat wave. Uh, that, that said, people are actually questioning the sudden spike in the number of patients and also in casualties in hospitals. Hospitals are actually flooded in, in many parts of eastern India. Uh, and then when I spoke to many of them, several people actually uh, said that this triggers memories of COVID uh, in them. So. Rajesh, we've got uh, federal help on the way here, sending assistance, uh, and I just want to have a, a corollary on top of that, which is unrelated. Uh, how does this affect the monsoon? Well, so so far we are seeing uh, monsoon has been below normal, and that is actually a problem. If if it continues to be like that, what it means is that it would create more pressure on coal, and when there is more pressure on coal, it's obviously going to translate into power supplies. And that is a bad news for heat waves. If heat waves persist and you do not have enough power supply, that kind of worsens the problem. And we are, we are already seeing this in, in the eastern part of the country where we, have, we are seeing frequent blackouts and because of which patients are having no electricity and, and no respite from the heat. Rajesh, are we seeing public outcry? Is it likely to be a political issue, especially for the elections? Well, I, there is certainly a public outcry. I, I do not know whether this is going to sustain uh, until, until the next year when the elections uh, are supposed to happen. Uh, but there is certainly a public outcry. Uh, I have spoken to, uh, you know, villages, uh, villages where uh, there are people dying every single day and people are really, really angry. People are asking the government to provide data. If, if the government is denying that these deaths are not attributable to heat waves, the people are asking the government to provide data and prove otherwise.